Today, I brought some pretty good news, but let me just start from the beginning. So as you've probably noticed, I haven't uploaded in a pretty long time. My last video is three weeks ago, and Toilet Tower Fence has been down for a while, but now I have some- this is where the good news comes back. Look at this! You can see the play button again! Toilet Tower Defense is finally back! It has returned. So in this video, I'm gonna be telling you guys some pretty important information and some of my plans. So the first thing, the big thing that I should mention is copyright. So right now, we actually have gotten a license. So now the game is a licensed Skivity Toilet game, and I now have the permit to finally, like, actually show Skivity Toilet stuff. So now, like, all the units, all the stuff that is protected by copyright, I now have a license to use all of that. So that is very, very good news. So that basically grants us the permission to use names for things and, like, other stuff stuff like that in the game, which means that we can keep updating it now as Skibbity Toilet episodes come out, which is really, really good because now we don't have to worry about any copyright issues or other things like that, and we have an official license and everything, so the game is going to be continued. Now, I'd like to thank Defook Boom for the license and just say that we will go on and work together to do new things for the game. We're gonna try to add a bit of great new content, like, as you guys know, I've been wanting to add some new game modes like an unlimited game mode and maybe even like a player versus player thing so we're gonna have to start working on that soon and we also did have a, a vip thing that we were working on so now that the game is back we're gonna continue that and on the palm paradise map we are gonna have a second spawn and it spawns like half the toilets on each spawn so there were a bit of plans we had and now we are gonna continue those so i can assure you guys we've got some cool things coming to the game soon so i'm not too sure how long the next update is going to take, but as there have been a bit of new Skibbity Toilet episodes and now we have a license, we're going to focus on adding some stuff that was shown in those episodes, so there are going to be a lot of new things. Most of them are probably going to be on Nightmare Mode, so Nightmare Mode is going to get even crazier. And then also some new units, and we're going to try to add a lot of them as Legendaries or Mythics, maybe some lower tier ones. Now for an update on my YouTube channel. So so basically, I know I haven't really uploaded in a while, but now I'm going to try my best to do daily uploads. Every now and then I might miss a day because right now I have been busy with a lot of other things, but I'm going to try my best to continue daily uploading like I used to because I think I daily uploaded pretty much like for a year straight, maybe like a year and a half. The only time that I missed uploads was when I was doing Pet Simulator X and I kind of ran out of ideas because they updated like every other week, but I missed very few days around that time and I I plan to continue doing daily uploads and pretty much my entire YouTube channel. Okay, I started out with like YouTube events and or no, not YouTube events, or Roblox events and tutorials. And then I did videos on popular games like around the time like Dungeon Quest, Saber Simulator, Bed Wars, Islands, Pet Simulator X. And recently, well, compared to the time of my entire YouTube channel existence, I started making my own games and then doing videos on them. And I find it really fun to make games. It's actually been a dream of mine ever since like I started playing Roblox in like 2013. I always wanted to own a popular game and now that dream is finally coming true. So I'm gonna continue to make games and do videos on them because okay whenever I did videos on like other people's games I had all these good ideas for the game and I just didn't really like some of the ways things were being run but I mean like if I if I own the game I can pretty much do whatever I want. So I mean like if I have a good idea for something that could be added to the game well then and we can add it. And then if I have a good idea for how something should be run, in my opinion, it's just a lot more fun. And Halloween is actually coming up soon. So the next big update is probably going to be all the things from the new episodes and some sort of a Halloween event. Now, I want to have a good Halloween event. And here's my plan. So my favorite thing in events in games is when there's like a special event currency and then maybe like an event shop. So we're probably going to have a Halloween crate and they're going to be, I don't know, just thinking on my mind like evil cameraman and then he's like evil and scary or something but i'll think of some pretty cool new units that are unique and put them in a crate and then you can maybe get the crate with the event tokens maybe they all are, will be like event quests so the event will have a shop the event will have event quests and maybe we'll even have a special event game mode like let me know in the comments what you guys think maybe we could have it where you get the event currency by beating maps normal 
normally and then like each mode can give a certain amount of that currency or we could have a completely unique event game mode maybe even the event could be like the first endless game mode and just depending on the wave you get to we have some sort of like complex math thing that you get a lot more by getting to later waves or something like that i don't know there are a lot of ideas so we'll figure out something before halloween and the event will be pretty fun we're gonna have to speed run though because i know it's already gonna take at least like a week or two to add like all the new toilets and units and then by that time it'll be like a little past the middle of october and i don't know if we can make the whole event in that time so the event might not be like super massive but i'll still try to make it as fun as possible i also haven't live streamed since i played pet simulator x so maybe for halloween if i'm not doing anything in real life i could do like a halloween live stream or something and maybe even have like a face cam but i'm wearing a halloween costume and the whole face reveal yet well maybe you guys will find out soon when i release my 1 million subscribers video another thing i'd like to mention okay the very first game i made on roblox was lettuce simulator and it was pretty mid for some reason though a youtuber tofu ended up playing it i am still very thankful that he played it because then it got like 400 players for a day but it had like really really bad uis and then i made a game with a scripter named evan and it was a bed break and that was kind of good we had around like 500 players at the peak but then it kind of died and the ui there was kind of bad the ui here isn't that bad it is kind of mid but personally i don't think it's like bad bad so also here's another fun fact i actually made all of the ui in this game so um whenever i make more games in the future i'm gonna get better at ui but this is pretty much like my my third game or like my third big project that i've worked on so in the future i'm gonna try to keep improving with like making ui and stuff i have learned a lot of designing stuff while making this game basically what i'm trying to say is i'm gonna continue making games and i'm gonna continue trying to improve on making them good but once again thank you to the fuke boom i'm glad we resolved everything and now we actually have a license but i really appreciate all your support so thank you guys for playing the game thank you guys for watching my youtube channel i want to make things that people enjoy so i have a lot of cool stuff coming soon a big thing that a lot of people were talking about where people were asking if like their data would save if the game comes back and now that the game is back well everyone's data is saved so we're gonna be able to resume you will have everything that you already had and i'm gonna try streaming more because like you, you can assign things and i haven't really signed that many things or really streamed the game at all so i'm gonna start doing that too sometimes i'm gonna try to do more videos with more of our partners and get involved in the community a bit more but yeah thank you all for watching make sure to subscribe with the notifications on if you haven't yet like the video and i'll see you all in the next video